welcome back to my channel so today I wanted to film this video uh, before I sort of just pick things up where I left off and before I continue creating new videos for you guys new content which I'm so excited about and hopefully you guys have been keeping up with my vlogs um, I wanted to do this video that I've been wanting to do for a while already and I was like today's the day I need to sit down I need to film it and I need to get it done now um, and it is the 50 things about me I just thought that you know picking things back up if anybody were to subscribe if you're not subscribed to subscribe to my channel you know that way you can get to know me and if you've been in my channel I've never really done anything like this so I figured it would be great so you can get to know me as well I don't know if I will have 50 things I hope um, I didn't really like write anything down or any of that sort I'm gonna just talk at the top of my head things about me like fun facts I don't know whatever comes to my mind and hopefully it's 50 things if not then Hopefully it's close to 50, but um, yeah, if you want to get to know a little about me, then just sit back and let's get started. Okay, so let's start off. Number one, I am 31 and a half years old. My middle name is actually my maiden name, Gastelum. I will forever at heart be Ashley Gastelum, which is the name of my channel, Ash Gastelum. Um, but when I got married, I did take my husband's last name, so I put my maiden name, my maiden last name into my middle name. I just I couldn't let go I am a teacher I am a mom I have a three and a half year old son Alejandro Jesus aka or better known as AJ um, Alejandro I just always love that name I know it's not about me but I just this I picked the Alejandro my husband agreed he liked it as well I've always liked the name Alejandro I feel like it's so Alejandro like hombre like it's so manly and Jesus son of a God I just we named him because of Jesus Christ and I know it's not really about him, but another fun fact, he was picked the name Alejandro Jesus. Jesus was always a set name. Alejandro, I had to pick a name with the letter A, and I always liked the name Alejandro because I wanted him to have my husband and my initials. When we were always dating, we were always like, oh, we're Team AJ when the whole Team Edward and Team Jacob thing were going on, Twilight. Um, yeah, I was into that stuff. I would always be like, we're Team AJ, Ashley, and Jeffrey, so I always wanted our first child to have our initials, AJ, so this is why we have AJ now, Alejandro Jesus. I cannot, cannot, cannot see from far away at all, like going blind almost, that's how bad it is. I absolutely love, 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 love cheese. Queso fresco in front of me, I can just eat the whole thing my favorite color is white um i don't know if technically it's not considered a color but i love 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 white like i love it in clothes i love it in home decor i love it i just love white i love it in my nail polish i always usually it's rare that i don't get white in my toes i love white i love to dance I love to sing. I wish I had the voice to sing because I just love to sing. I can just, I sing all the time, anywhere, everywhere. My shower is like my concert hall. I just love to sing. I do love all types of music. Um, I listen to pretty much anything and everything, like pretty much any genre and type of music. I just absolutely love. I love music. I take that after my dad. Um, I just absolutely love, love, love music. My favorite animal are giraffes. I love giraffes. I mean, I do love dogs, but like that, like pets, I love, love dogs, but giraffes are my animals. I just love giraffes. They're so tall, like me. I just, I just think they're the cutest. And with that said, I am a 5'7. My birthday is January 24, 1988. My favorite food is enchiladas. Enchiladas de queso fresco are my ish. I just love them. Um, I just, enchiladas, I can just eat them all the time. I don't like making them, preparing them, but I love them. And I would have to say, runner up would have to be enchiladas de carne molida. Mm. So good, I'm getting hungry already. So good. I love, love, love enchiladas. Soy mexicana. I am terrified to the core of sharks. I cannot see sharks. I cannot see sharks in a book. I cannot see sharks on TV. I just cannot see sharks, especially if they're like mouth wide open. I cannot 
see sharks. I am terrified of them. Like I have a real fear of sharks because I feel like they're gonna come out under my shower. Like I am terrified of sharks. And I'm not as terrified as dinosaurs, but I can't see them with their big old, like I've never seen Jurassic Park because I'm just terrified of them. I just can't, it's a real thing. I just cannot see them. I have two sisters. I have an older sister and a younger sister and I am the middle one. I did not go to second grade. I went from first grade to third grade and I skipped second grade. Apparently I knew everything I needed to know that I was gonna cover in second grade. So I skipped one grade from first to third. And and with that, my favorite subject in school has always been English. I love writing essays and I'm putting essays together. English is my forte. I love to dress up. That has always, always been my persona. Ever since I was a little girl, when I was in elementary, every Friday I had to wear a dress to school with like my little heels and like those like fluffy little socks. I've always loved to dress up. And I am such a girly girl. I am the girliest girl out of my sisters. I'm so girly, I've always been girly, like I've said. Um, I've always loved like earrings and bracelets and makeup and jewelry and heels and I am such a girly girl. My favorite show in the whole world is Sex and the City. I love Sex and the City. I can watch the reruns over and over and over and over every single day if I could. I wish I could. I have all the seasons and all the movies. I love Sex and the City, hence, why my name on Instagram, my handle was Fashionista and the City. Fashionista, me and the city because my favorite show ever. I love Carrie Bradshaw. I just absolutely loved her. And fun fact, um, next fact, when I got married with my husband, I did wear the white dress and the blue heels. Unfortunately, we're not the Manolos, but I did wear the blue heels just like Carrie Bradshaw got married too big in the movie, through court, white dress, blue heels. That's just what I did. I love Carrie and I would love to have two dogs one day. Name one Carrie and one Big. I have one pet right now, one dog. I have a miniature pin miniature pincher. Her name is Mandy and we adopted her and I've always had a thing for adopting um, and I'm so happy that we adopted our very first pet and I would one day maybe hope to be able to adopt. I don't know if it's in my destiny, but I really hope to be able to adopt a child one day. I love plants. My favorite sport is basketball. I love basketball. I went through a hardcore basketball phase in, my, in high school. All Jordans, I was all about basketball. I still really like basketball, I just don't have as much time to sit down and watch a game, but I love, love, love basketball. It's my favorite sport. Soccer is a good close second. I mean first. I got married when I was 27 years old. One of my pet peeves is when you're heating up something in the microwave and you stop it before it actually, the time is actually up and before it beeps and you leave it like at three seconds, the microwave, and you don't clear it, you don't reset, that ticks me off. Like, please reset the, I don't know, as small as and as dumb as it may be, it is a pet peeve of mine, I just can't stand it. I do not like feet at all, I do not like feet. I don't like touching feet. I don't even like touching my own feet. I It's been so long. It's been a year since I've cut my own toenails. I have been getting petties and not cut my toenails for years. Like over, it's been years. I just don't like feet. I don't do feet. I don't like anybody touching my feet and I don't like touching feet. No. The only people that get to touch my feet are the people that do my petties. I love romantic comedies. I am a huge, huge, hopeless romantic. I am a super corny. I love all those mushy mushy lovey dovey stuff. I love all of that. I'm just a huge, huge hopeless romantic. I love watermelon. Watermelon is my favorite fruit. I love watermelon. I get so excited when the season comes around because it's watermelon season and I just absolutely love watermelon, especially with some limon and tahini. I am a sucker for sweets. I love sweets. I have a huge sweet tooth. I always love to have a little something sweet after I'm done eating dinner. As funny as it may sound, I know I'm not the only one out there. I love sweets. My weakness are donuts. My favorite ice cream flavor is cookies and cream. I have a really loud voice by nature. I do not like my writing. I don't like my writing. I feel like I write horrible as hard as I try. I, try, I like start off by writing a little bit decent. Then it starts getting messy and just funky and I just don't like my writing. I majored in liberal studies. As crazy as it may sound, 
one state that I've always really wanted to go to for years and still want to and I hope to one day go is Alaska. A YouTuber that has inspired me always and continues to inspire me and that I look up to and hope to one day be able to meet is Dulce Candy. I love to watch her. I love to watch her videos. I relate to her on so many levels. The blogger that actually inspired me and to want to get into blogging was Sazan Hendricks. Um, I clearly remember it was around, I want to say 2014. I was sitting in one of my um, elective classes, it was like music for children, um, at Cal State LA, and I was on my phone because I was early into class, and I was scrolling, and somehow, I don't know how I came across to her page, and it was one of like the first bloggers I ever came across on Instagram, and then I started reading her blog, and I started, like, she would share her outfits and where she got them from, and I just, I was like, oh my god. One, I love to shop. Two, I love to put outfits together. I just, like, I love styling, I love fashion, and I was like, I want to be able to do this. I used to feel embarrassed of being so tall. I, before, I would not wear high heels, and I would always think to myself, man, those girls that are shorter than, that are like, not as tall as me, so lucky that they get to wear high heels and really high heels and I felt like because I was so tall I was only wear, able to wear like the little heel and for so long I would abstain myself from buying high heels because I felt like I just couldn't do it because I was already really tall and now I embrace it, I wear it, I don't care if I'm like six feet tall with them, I wear my high heels, I love it, I embrace my long legs, love them, I love being tall now. I have dyed my hair so many times that is the one thing I'm always like changing around. I get really bored of like the same look and style quick. I have done my hair, I have dyed my hair red, like aerial red, like Little Mermaid red. I've had it red, I've had it blonde, super blonde, I've had it ombre, I've had it lavender, I've had it gray, I've had it black, and now I have like highlights again. I might go even lighter soon. I just love changing my hair and I've had bangs. I've had really short hair like up to here. I do not know how to swim. I do not know how to ride a bike. I do not know how to rollerblade. I do not know I was always, I guess you could say I'm a scary cat and I never learned and now I really don't care to learn. I just rather AJ learn. I don't really care to learn. Uh, maybe I guess swimming, I wouldn't mind learning so I can swim with him once he learns. But I'm terrified of the water. Terrified of the water? Another fact. I often get that people don't believe me that I know how to speak Spanish. So many times I've gotten the, you know how to speak Spanish? Like, yes, soy mexicana, me encanta hablar español. Estoy muy orgullosa de saber el español. Um, I don't know why it's a surprise to many, but I can take really long showers. I can be either super fat or super long. There's no in the middle. Either I'm like in and out or I'm like, Damn girl, what are you doing in there? I just, it's my alone time, it's my relaxing time. I can take really long showers and I can never really shower with cold water. It always has to be more warm than it is cold like right now, but it's always warm or more on the hotter side. One of my favorite restaurants is Buffalo Wild Wings. I love wings. I love to read. I love books i love 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 to read now and it's so funny and crazy to me because when i was younger like excuse me in my 20s and as a teen i never loved reading books i detested reading books i never liked books i would always say the, the furthest thing i get to reading is mag a magazine i would never ever read books and now i can't put books down I okay guys that is the end of the video um, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and learned a little bit more about me. Any other, I don't know if you have anything in common or any questions or anything, leave your comment down here below. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to give it a big old thumb and subscribe to my channel if you're not subscribed already. And then also follow me on my social media. I'm going to leave all the links down here below. Um, what else? I think that is it. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.